Hey guys, it's Phase 1. In this video, you're going to learn how to use the new scan mode in Star Citizen. If you're new to this channel, we do all kinds of Star Citizen content. So make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification button so that you don't miss out on future videos. I also stream on Twitch every Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. So if you have any questions or if you just want to hang out, make sure to leave me a follow there as well. All my links are down below. And without any further ado, let's get started. To enter into scan mode, use the V key. As you look around, your scanner will be able to detect scannable objects such as these. If you hover your scanner over them, it will detect its signature here. You can zoom in on an object for further focus by scrolling the middle mouse button. Doing this will increase its signature. Notice when I focus on the station off in the distance, its signature increases. To detect objects further away, you can use ping with the tab key. As you can see, there are a lot of interesting signatures around that your passive radar wasn't picking up earlier. You can adjust the field of view of your ping with the comma and period keys. Your ship HUD will display the general area of any detected low signatures with small cubes. The stronger the signature, the closer the cubes will be to each other. To scan an object, you can hold the left mouse button. The amount of information you can retrieve on an object depends on how close you are to the object. Notice I am able to scan a mineable asteroid and retrieve more information as opposed to the previous attempt. Just a quick tip, once you scan an object, your ship scanner will store that data in its data bank. This way you'll not need to rescan it later. Here's an example of what scanning a ship looks like. It will give you a general silhouette of the ship and provide details pertaining to the owner, faction, ship health, components, etc. Another quick tip is that you can use the left shift and tab to gain access to your cursor, which will allow you to scroll for more information like so. Using left shift and tab again will revert the cursor. Was this guide helpful? Let me know in the comments below. If there's anything in this video that you like, make sure to leave a like. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more. I will see you on the next one.